Hi, welcome back to the Chop Life channel where we chop life so life doesn't chop you. In this video, I'm going to be telling you the story of how I got chased by ops twice in one day. This was back when I was about 13, 14 years old. And I can't lie, I was a good you blood. But my friends back then, them man there was wonguns. Them man loved to cause trouble and that. Like even when I used to play knock down ginger fam, as soon as I knock on that door, I'm running like I'm getting chased by feds blood. Man would always cause myself to have a cardiovascular arrest blood. But true say I'd rather get arrested by my cardiovascular system than feds. So two twos now, I went out bike riding around the streets with a few of my friends. Two twos now, we're just riding our bikes around the streets. And we pass a little estate down the road from our house. And we see an older group of guys just banging ball blood. And one of my boys, let's call him Chubbs for the sake of the video. Even though Chubby was an understatement by a mile. But yeah, we move. He decides to stop about 30 meters away from these guys. Two twos now, we all stop and go back to him and i'm like bro why, why are you stopping blood just ride your bike and chubbs is like i dare you to shout a swear word at them and i'm like bro them man look like they're twice the size of us are you normal man them i was under peer pressure so i said listen if you man do it first i'll do it so my boy Chubb starts shouting swear words at these guys playing football. Like he's over here calling them fat shits and that blood. I'm thinking, bro, relax, bro. That's friendly fire right there. You can't do that. You know them boy there, you man look the same. But I can't lie, it did look pretty fun shouting swear words at these random people. But two twos now, these guys stop playing football and turn around. Them man there clocked that we shouting swear words at them. Two twos now, the biggest guy in that group starts walking towards us swearing at us now. Two twos now, I'm thinking this is all fun and games blood you know them boy there a man's violating him but it was only one guy walking towards us the rest of his friends were still playing football blood you know them boy there but i can't lie he was one fat ginger guy bro so i did the quick mathematics in my head i was thinking there's me and three of my boys and one fat fuck coming towards me i think i will take those odds you know them boy there and at this point my boys were behind me and they stopped shouting out violations and that but me i was keeping it up blood i was applying the pressure with the violations and that I was dishing out every your mum joke I had in the books, blood. You know them boy there. Bro, I was having the time of my life violating this one Donny fam. I even started violating the fact that he was ginger, blood. I said, huh? Got your soul. <laughs> you know them boy there, fam. Bro, back then, that was one of the most popping ginger jokes ever, blood. So two twos now, this fat ginger kid starts running, fam. And he's only about 10 meters from me at that point. And that's when the confusion hit. I said, bruv, there's four of us. There's one of you. Why, why are you going to come and chase us? Like, we can chase you. So two twos now, I turn around. The man them were gone, blood. Not one person in sight. I can't lie, man, them. I shit myself. But he's a good 10 meters away from me. I could have just rode off. You know, them boy there, I had a bike. But my brain was so discombobulated, I forgot that two wheels is faster than my two blood clot legs. You know, them boy there. So me, I hopped off my bike and started running along, pushing my bike. Man, them, I can't lie. I was dashing for my life, dragging my bike with me, bruv. You know, them boy there. I did not look back once, fam. After 30 seconds of dashing for my life, I look around and I see this guy is nowhere to be seen. You know them boy there. I don't think his cardiovascular system had the capacity to chase me like that. So two twos now, I ride my bicycle back to my estate. And I see the man them just there chilling. And I'm like, yo man them, you man just left me for dead. Man nearly got eaten up by a hungry fat ginger done blood. You know them boy there, why go on for you man? Two twos now, my other friends go home and it's just me and Chubbs left. So we decided to go on a two man bike ride thing, you feel me? Two twos now, I'm about 10 minutes from my yard. And we're just cruising down the streets on our bikes two twos now we're riding past this park and we just see a massive group of asian boys chilling in this one park and you see me i was just looking at them for a little bit because i was thinking yo you man look a bit too old to be chilling in a park you know them boy there and when all of a sudden these asian guys jump up and start shouting at us blood and i'm looking around like who the fuck you shouting at? I'm just a kid. Like, it can't be me. Like, what did that do, fam? Like, someone did something to these Asian guys because they're angry. Two twos now. I don't know why these group of Asian guys are angry. You know them boy there? I don't know if it's me, someone else. Who pissed these motherfuckers off? I don't know. They started running in my direction. I thought, all right, cool. Let me speed up with the cycling. You know them boy there? Just in case these guys are coming after me, bruv. Two twos now. These guys start dashing stones at us, blood. I had stones pinging off my back, left, right, and center, fam. I 
said, yeah, I think these guys are angry at us. I don't know if it's mistaken identity or something, but when I started seeing stones whizzing past my head top, I thought, yeah, let me step on the accelerator. So I started pedaling for my life. But two twos now, I look back at my boy and he gets off his bike. And I'm thinking, bro, what are you doing, blood? We're getting chased by a group of Asian guys throwing stones at us, blood. And then he starts running with his bike. And then I clocked, his bike chain fell off. And then I thought, right, I gotta go help my boy, bro. So two twos now, I kept on pedaling as fast as I could all the way home, blood. You know them boy there. I listen, one man dying instead of two is always a good option. Listen, man, them, I didn't hear from him until the next day, but listen, I heard from him the next day, he survived. Man just had a couple bruises from the stones and that. But listen, no pain, no gain, you know, them boy there. Listen, if you did enjoy that video, please hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, and I shall see you in the next video. Peace.